My name is Tanuj Goenka, and I'm a director at Kerry Hill Architects Singapore Studio. One of our most recent projects is Amanyangyun, which is a resort located a short distance from downtown Shanghai. And it consists of 24 guest rooms, 43 villas, public areas which include conference facilities, F&B outlets, a large spa, and the heart of the project is the cultural center or the Nan Shufang. The Amun Yang Yun journey started 16 years ago when our client, Mr. Ma, went back to his village in Jiangxi province and discovered that an entire forest of camphor trees and a village of antique houses was being flooded due to a dam project. Our client decided to move the camphor trees and the antique houses to Shanghai, which was 600 kilometers away, in order to preserve them. It was a mammoth task. We were introduced to the project by Amun Resorts. Amun asked us to get involved as the designers for the project. We had the antique houses, as well as the camphor trees, as elements which had to be woven into the master plan. And our concept for Amun Yangyun was to create a walled village which consists of a series of courtyards. Guests move from one courtyard to another as part of their progression from arrival to their villas or the hotel. Each of these courtyards have a distinct character reminiscent of the courtyard houses and the villages in Jiangxi province. The organization of the contemporary guest room around internal courtyards comes from traditional Chinese architecture. Amun Yang Yun is a living museum with not just the antique houses, but also the guest experience. Guests can learn calligraphy, can become part of an incense ceremony. There are tea rooms and exhibition spaces there. The client wanted Amun Yang Yun to be designed in such a way that it showcases Chinese culture and way of life.